at 1 Samuel chapter 16, verse 7, as our scripture on this 10-minute word break. But the Lord said unto Samuel, now the Lord was speaking to Samuel, they in the outward being, they were picking another person to be the king. So the Lord had to intervene even in the prophet Samuel's life. Our father has to intervene in our lives and get our situations straight. Samuel looked not on his countenance. Do not look on the outward being or on the height of his statue. Don't look on someone for how they look, how tall they are, the Lord was telling Samuel. When the father picks you and chooses you for an assignment. He does not look at how you look or how you feel about yourself or your height. The Father looks at your heart because I have refused him. 1 Samuel chapter 16, verse 7. The Lord tells Samuel, the person you're looking at, that's not the one. It's the person that you are talking to in a dating relationship. They may not be the one. You may be looking at their height and how good looking or how beautiful that lady is. But the Lord is saying to you, I have refused them for you. We must have a keen understanding of the voice of God. We must be people that seek out the voice of God. For the Lord sees not as a man sees, or as a lady sees. We need to receive this into our spirit I hope the Spirit of God that lives within you as a believer right now. For the Lord sees not as man sees. Will you say that with me again? For the Lord sees not as man sees. When we see each person, each individual in our daily lives, in the grocery store, at work, or walking down the sidewalk, or in the mall. The Lord does not look at the outward appearance. For man looks on the outward appearance. There are too many today looking at what they can see. They're looking to numbers. And it all looks and the figures add up and it, they're doing great. But the Father is not looking for the outward appearance in choosing someone to serve Him. I praise His holy name today. For the Lord looks 
on the heart. First Samuel chapter 16, verse 7. For the Lord looks on the heart. When you look at someone today, will you look at their heart and not the way they look? Oh, praise God. Will you look at someone's heart today and not how they appeal to your eyes? Because that's the way the Father looks at all of us. Oh, receive that. I'm receiving it as I speak to you today because we move people out of our lives based on how they look. And the father is saying to us today, that's the wrong way to look at people. Will you please take for Samuel chapter 16, verse 7, with you when this broadcast is over. And you would read it to yourself over and over again. But the Lord looks on the heart. The Lord is looking on your heart right now. Because You have walked past people. I have walked past people that God's hand was upon. And because of the way they looked with their countenance and their statue, I refused them. I walked on. You have done the same thing. We as believers today must repent of that. And in our notes, and only God knows the heart of man. Only God knows your heart. If Samuel had not listened to the voice of God, King David would never have been anointed as king of Israel. We must be very careful when God speaks. Are you listening for the voice of the Father today? Let me read 1 Samuel chapter 16, verse 7 again to you. But the Lord said unto Samuel, Look not on his countenance or on the height of his statue, because I have refused him. For the Lord sees not as man sees. For the man looks on the outward appearance. Oh, come on, someone. But the Lord looks on the heart. Will you start looking on the heart of individuals today and not the way they look? I love you today. I love you today. And the Father loves you. I'm Pastor David Ray of Growing Together Ministry Worldwide, Lewiston, Woodville, North Carolina. Join us again for the 10-minute word break on Kingdom Purpose Television and the various Growing Together Ministry platforms online. God bless.